Mi amor, you make me un poco Yo, what up gamers? It's me, I'm back. I took a week break from BDO because I was getting burnt out. I uh, I filled a uh, 16 pen dandy attempt. So I promised you guys I wouldn't burn out in BDO. And so to combat that, because I was burning out pretty hard. Because, you know, I hit 278 3 AP really quick. And uh, with the 16 pen dandy fills, I've just been going really hard lately. So I took a, I took a week off. And uh, after that week, I was good to go. And then I, I, started, I started coming back just by getting into streaming. So we've been streaming pretty often as of recent. So uh, yeah, that's where I was. That's why I wasn't uploading. I needed that, I needed that break. Honestly, I was just streaming random games during the time. But now we are refreshed up and we're ready for the grind once again. You guys are probably like, uh, why are you at Mansions, dude? You should go to Achman Forehead. You're gonna make so much more money. And uh, honestly, let me let me tell you something. I'm actually out of loot scrolls, and so without loot scroll, I'm pulling like 5.5k trash at uh, Aukman, and uh, I I really just it just it doesn't feel like it's good money. Like I'll get like six to seven scrolls an hour, and if that's all I'm getting, I, I want to go for the consistent money. So uh, now now Musa is one of the best classes, if not the best class, at Manjums. And uh, with my current gear, I'm pulling like uh, 4k trash per hour, like anywhere from 4k to 4.3. Just depends how uh, focused I am, how much PvP I get. And uh, with with Narc earrings on the rise, it's worthwhile right now. Um, I'm making like 70 to 80 mil an hour, and without loose scroll, I think that's really good. And uh, with that in mind, uh, it's also going to be a nice breather from Aukman. So. So if you guys are wondering why I'm at Manchums, it's mainly because I just need a breath of fresh air from Aukman. And uh, so I'll probably be going back and forth between like Manchums, Mirrors, and Star's End. Once I feel like I am uh, ready for Aukman again, I'll, I'll, I'll uh, start grinding there again. But uh, I'm making excellent money at Manchums, so I can't complain. Also, I'm going to be making a decision if I am just going to buy my pen dandy or not. I know I've said this 20,000 times before. You always say you're gonna buy and then you tap it and then you get RNG carried and then you get it. But uh, no, I'm actually serious about uh, possibly buying the pen dandy because I, you know, with the 16 fails, I've seen people fail 50 times and I don't want that to be me and I wanna keep up the speedy progress. So I think the smartest thing that I could do to keep up that, that to keep up that progress is uh, possibly just buying that pen dandy. I think that's gonna be the play. So I have to save up about 25 bill, which is a lot. That's that's gonna roughly take me about about um maybe 30 to 45 days of like five hour grinds if I can maintain that. That's like a lot of grinding I'd have to do, and I'd have to have the time to do that. So I know people are gonna ask, why am I in Pariah? <laughs> um. So, uh, just a TLDR version, I, uh, we dropped the guild because, uh, basically we recruited 30 to 45 players. I brought them from 300 gear score to the point of where they were hitting 261 to 289 AP. The problem was, is that they didn't have an interest in PvP when I recruited specifically for PvP. And that's just not what I was going for. So instead of rebuilding the guild with PvPers, because you know it, it takes a lot of time to grow guilds. Um, I called that off, and I just didn't want to deal with it because it, it was really, really frustrating that I helped all these people gear up, and they barely showed up for PvP, and they, and another thing was is that they didn't have PvP experience, and they had no interest in getting the PvP experience either. I just wasn't cool with that. So for now, I'm in, uh, I'm in Pariah. I brought a lot of core members to the guild as well, and there's going to be more joining up still. There's some of them are like a little busy right now, but uh, it, it, it's 50/50 if uh, I I uh, bring the guild back later. Just for now, I want to help all my old members at 281 AP, and I want to hit that too. So, if you guys haven't noticed, I haven't been grinding Arsha in a very very long time, so. I'm gonna bring back the Arsha-styled PvP videos for a little bit. <laughs> yeah, boy. 
uh, it's going to be wherever I grind. So now that I do have a lot of gear, chances are most of the time people are going to have less gear than me. There's going to be that occasional time there were some dude super geared and it's just going to be frustrating. But uh, just so you guys know, whenever I fight an Arsha, if someone's less geared than me, I'll try and do my best to uh, sometimes just drop gear and wreck them because, uh, you know, I'm not gear carried. <laughs> I came from 170 AP at Arsha Gaha, so I know what I'm doing. So if you ever find someone who's just like, you know, getting out SA traded, I'm just two-shotting him. We'll, uh, we'll drop gear down to 170 AP. We'll see what happens, but you know, why don't we end the last half of the video with some Arsha PvP. We'll go looking for it, so let's do it. All right, brosephines, grab your bro electrolyte water because I'm going in with 19301. Ready? I'm just waiting for it. Come to it. I'm an iframe. Uh, he grabbed me during iframe, but let's find some desync. I didn't get hit. Oh, wee! Hell yeah, dude. Feels good. Should we drop more? I don't know. I'm gonna drop more. I'm gonna drop more. We're gonna go 179. I'm going in with 179. And then we'll put on the gear just to meme this guy. Come here. Get off. Get off. Get off. Um. Huh? huh? Um. Wait. What? Hold on. Hold up. I need to see this. I need to actually confirm. Well, we're putting on the accessories. Okay, guys. Ninja's really hard for Musa. Let's see what I can do. I'm gonna Z buff this guy. All I have to do is wait for them to do this forward chop. I think that's it. He just did malice right there and got punished, so. Unsafe. His V's gonna be over in a sec. Okay, it's over. Got his back right there with the dragon bite. He's done for. He's an immune, so he should, he should have some gear. I'm gonna go after him at node and see what's up. Unsafe Serpent Ascension. I can just linger and I say and probably kill him because he tries to come in. He's backing off. He's being a little smart. Okay, cool. Four chop. There it is. Who this? Uwu? What is that? Oh, it's a lawn. Go fight, man. Go fight. Go. F oh, he, he, uh. No, 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 no. No dash for you, brother. Nuh uh. He pearl wrist. Mm, you got a striker who's almost out of health me. This guy's gear is insane. Cannot trade with them. that say trades there i just tried to make sure like because he's just gonna linger essays and then go for grab so with the amount of gear he had because he deleted me like in a couple hits just you know throw your essays out and like that's it leave that's all you can do
Alrighty guys, that's gonna be it for today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Uh, we're gonna be back to uploading now. I'm fresh and ready for the grind. We'll see what happens with this pen dandy. Um, if, you, if you guys enjoyed, make sure you guys hit that sub button, hit the like button, and give me a comment down below. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter and to join the community Discord. I'm out, guys. Peace.